Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Sushi. Today we're gonna play Oxen Free. Uh, hey, my face is there. Hey. Nice. It used to be a military base. Well, it used to be a ranching thing, then it was turned into an army thing, then it became a bird thing and a museum or whatever. Henry Fonda stationed here, I think, for a bit. Unless he was Navy. Who's Henry Fonda? Around Christmas time, this little breakfast place used to sell these amazing polar bear sugar cookies. Man, those were good. And then one year they changed the formula or whatever and ruined it. Wait, wait, wait. Oh my god, is there any... Uh... Subtitle, subtitle, subtitle... Yeah... Yeah... Alex? Hey, still with us? You haven't said anything for like 10 minutes. Oh, I'm listening. Mission control to Alex. I can watch the hypnotic rolling of the waves and listen to you at the same time. Oh, okay. What did I say? Little Miss, I can see and hear things at the same time. Um, something about Bird Island or pancakes. I don't know. Perfect. I didn't say that. <laughs> You're right on the money. So you all moved in? Um, not, not really. I just got in this morning. And how did her mom meet your dad exactly? <laughs> they met on vacation in Orlando. He got lost in a... You know, actually, I'm not even going to tell this story. It's really not worth it. No way. <laughs> okay. No, wait. What happened? I feel like I haven't heard this. He got lost in some gardens, and he thought she worked there, and blah, blah, blah. They hit it off. Aw, uh, that's downright adorable. And you guys just met tonight? Yeah, I was, um, I'd been out of school, and the timing had just never worked out, so... And what does that make you to her, then? Hey, uh, second cousin? I don't know how people math works. Um, stepbrother, technically. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm sweet. I forgot that was even a oh. thing. Well, at least you seem cool, right? Cool guy, cool hat. You get a cool new sibling living right in your house, sharing your toothbrush. Yeah, no, it's a... Nice perk, I guess. Unless you're like a pyro or something. I very Just lost. a klepto. <gasps> so you're in luck. <gasps> so, how do you two know each other? Oh, from way back when, like Paleozoic. Grade school era. Young enough that I've seen her in a bathtub and it wasn't sexual at all. I mean, we both looked like little skinned potato blobs. Ugh, it's so creepy now to think about. Why? We were babies. It's funny, that's all. Check under your seat to make sure you don't leave behind any grandchildren. Uh, -huh. uh so how do you? It's a recording. They always play. Oh, oh, we should get a quick picture. All of us. This will be like the before. Yeah, let's do it. And it's Jonas, not Jonah. Yeah, Jonas, like Jonas Salk, right? Patient zero, AIDS guy. Jonas. It means oppressor, right? Yeah. But I mean, my sign's cancer, and it's not like my hair's falling out or anything. Here's good. Come on, Alex, join the fun. Click there, click. great. I'll magic erase all the warts out and stuff, so don't worry. Right. Hey, Alex, you brought the radio, right? The little portable one? Yeah, of course. Of course. Perfect. Can you pull it out a second? There's the little guy. Our high school has a radio station, and Carly, she's a friend of ours. Uh, she's filling in because Reggie got mono from some track runner or something. It doesn't matter. What matters is that she's going to say something like, basically, right now, about our thing. So, tune it to 88.3 so I can tell her we heard it. 88.3. It's, uh, to the left of the dial? 88.3. Which I played because that song's been stuck in my head since I woke up this morning. Yeah. But, oh, oh, actually, it's a little after 10 o'clock, which means my dear friend Ren and his buddies are probably just touching down on Edwards Island for the yearly bash on the beach or whatever we call it now. But anyways, I promised him that I'd play a song from his band, so hope you're listening, Ren. Here are the red-headed bedwetters with baby carrots. <laughs> Ah, that's Why awesome. I hope Christina, with her talent show judge face, was listening. We 
must be getting close. There's no radio reception on the island. I'm glad I got to hear it before it went totally kaput. If we can't kaput. use it, why'd you bring it? Not just for the boat. Um, no. You'll see. I don't expect too much, but nah, it'll be fun. I won't undercook it. You'll see. Okay, I'll see. Nice picture, da boy. Smell that clean air, boys and girls. Boy and girl. This ain't city living. Yeah, um, anybody need a smoke? I have a full pack. No. Uh, oh, uh, no thanks. I mean, I literally just said the clean air thing, so... Alex, you can bum one off me if you're empty. I forget if you're a fellow addict. No thanks. Oh, uh, no thanks. I don't smoke. Last time I had one, it didn't go well. Yeah, no, I didn't know what coughing with your whole body meant until I saw you dry heaving. <laughs> Okay, just checking. Mm. All right, my other friend should be up and around the bend. Actually, that, I mean, I don't mean to be the guy to break us up already, but Ren, can you do me a favor? Can I have like two real quick minutes with Alex for a second? What and the you can, you know, you can run up and meet. Wait, is, is something wrong? What is it? Nothing's wrong, nothing's wrong. It'll just take two minutes, super fast. All right, but <laughs> uh, look, I, I don't want to go up by myself. I mean, can't we just stick together? You're gonna have all night to say, like, whatever. whatever. But since you want to meet up with your friends anyway... We're all gonna meet up with them. No, it's... it's fine, Ren. Go on up ahead and we'll catch up with yeah, you. Yeah, we'll up. Um, okay. I guess. Though this is a really strange way to start off, splitting up. It'll be fast. Thanks, man. I'll just be up the hill, in case... whatever. Ren seems nice. He's funny, you know? Yeah, what do you want yeah, to he's... <sighs> Look, just what did you want to talk to me about before I suspect something nefarious? No, it's nothing. It's not bad. Listen, I just wanted to grab you ahead of time and say you've been cool about everything. And I guess it's just for me, I, I, I've never moved anywhere. And like getting a new family at the same time kind of feels like I'm skipping the training wheels. <laughs> not that it's been bad or anything. You and your mom have been great. Uh, we'll make do. Lemons, lemonade, however that goes. An optimist. Oh, Christ. Mm. Oh, and thanks for setting up the attic for me. It's cool how it's like a little bedroom. I was in the basement at my old house. Yeah, no, no problem. problem. Anytime. It's nice at night, isn't it? <laughs> Can we go yeah. on already? We can catch back up with Ren now. I didn't mean to take so long. Okay, let's go then. What's this? Off-road. Store. You know what, let's just go back. Where's Ren? this was even here it's a monument to some submarine that was sunk off the coast uh -uh. oh do the the um the radio guide thing they talked about on the boat you know it's what like 102.3 uh okay sure i think they said it's 102.3 yeah whatever but maybe i heard wrong Ah, you know what? It's all right. I, I don't need to hear it. We can maybe come back later. Yeah. Yeah, just get on with it. Get on with it, boy. Chop. Hello, kids. Look, the other guys and gals must be further up, so be quick now. Okay, speed read definition of Edwards Island. This is a tourist trap with shops and a beach. Mm -mm. Nobody lives here except for some geriatric named Mrs. Adler. But, as God is my witness, we'll never mention her or any other old person's name again. All right. We are here to drink and be stupid. A tradition apparently started by bored recruits in the 1950s who would sneak dates over from the coastal towns. They literally called it trawling. Uh-huh. Really? That's kind of gross. Gross. Yeah. Sex. The beaten path officially ends here. The beach is past the fence. I think Jerry told me that there's a way that you used to get over there, but I'm blanking on what it was. But it's not... I mean, it can't be too difficult. Well, look, there must be something. I mean, if Jerry got over. 
Map. Yeah, exactly. So, to summarize, we are not allowed here after dark. The town is shut down, and we, the Kamina High Junior Class, have come to commit improper acts. What? And the other thing is the weirdo caves. Weirdo caves? The whole reason Alex brought her radio is because when you go to the... It's like the front. The mouth. The mouth of this particular cave, you can sometimes pick up frequencies to stations that don't exist. Whoa. You'll hear voices or just sounds. No, <laughs> no way. way. Come on. Alex has always been a devout skeptic, even though the fourth grade field trip proved it without a shadow of a doubt. Oh, God. Whatever. Whatever. So, back up a second. Who's Mrs. Adler? Her family, I think, like, owns or owns some of the island or something. She's been shacked in the same spot for like 70 years. She's kind of what you'd call the local legend. She has a house on the other side of the woods. Yo, yo, yo! Ma'am, that woman won the life lottery. 70 years of sleeping with the window open and smelling the ocean. You'd be okay with never leaving. Never leaving. Just there. All the time. Yeah. Why wouldn't I be? If you're happy, you're happy. Why would you move? Yeah. Why would you? Jonas. Did you know that a little birdie told me that our Alex here is thinking of going out of state to college? Oh, really? Yeah, so... I don't know who you heard that from, but I'm not. Not really. All right, well, cool, I guess. I just... If you are thinking of leaving, I just hope you're doing it for the right reasons. That's all. That's my whole spiel. I said I don't really know yet, okay? You're witnessing the ground floor of the decision-making process. I have no idea. Uh, okay, okay, that's all I wanted to hear. I said my piece. <sighs> Sheesh. Thanks so much for bringing me out, you guys. I can tell I'm gonna have a really good time. We, um, we don't normally bicker so much. Uh -huh. Yes, normally I just agree with whatever she says. So this is unusual. I think the dumpster will get us over if it'll budge. Well, let's try it. Try. This music's on next I was just saying, but yeah. They just jumped. They jump down. 9 p.m. Oh, uh, before we get there, I should I should probably mention that. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Who's that? That's so there's this girl, Nona. She's just this girl, and I'm totally into her, and I want her to be into me. So just, you know, just be cool, okay? No pouting or complaining or anything, alright? Right. Deal? Relax. Hmm. Oh, what was the thing you wanted to say to Alex, Jonas? You can just pretend I'm like a stray dog and can't understand. Yeah, what was it really, Jonas? If you have some deep, dark secret, I'd like to know now before we're officially housemates. I'll just talk to you later, seriously. Huh? Reginald, I hear you over there. Hey, guys. Wait, I was saying, I was about to tell a story. What was it? About Brad's car. Oh, well, that can wait. Hey, we started a fire down the way, but Nona wanted to play beach nanny, so... Uh, yeah. Hi. Hi. And Jonas, that's... Who are you? Jonas. That's Jonas. He's Alex's new in town, fresh as the daisy stepbrother. Stepbrother? Really? Yeah, I know. It's a trip, right? Yeah, he's a cool guy from cool North Valley, so let's all try and show him a good time. <laughs> Just the beach and some beer will be enough, I'm sure. Wait, 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 wait. You're Jonas. Jonas, the stepbrother. Yeah. Um, what's your name again? That is Clarissa. How but is she's... your stepbrother? Like, what does that even mean? Um... I'll give you three guesses. <laughs> Her mom's getting remarried, that's all. She's getting remarried to a guy, and that's the guy's son, so... Domino effect? Domino effect. Yeah, well, I guess this is happening now. This is a thing that is happening, so... <sighs> Where's everyone else? Nicole had that tennis thing. And? Uh, 
Who else was supposed to come? Anyone? Everyone? Clarissa, we... <laughs> we took the last ferry. I thought more would show up, but... <laughs> oh my god, it's just Alex and her new stepbrother? <laughs> That's it. That's who you brought. Uh... That's the group. Clarissa, come on. Don't be mean. This is supposed to be fun. I'm a fun person. <laughs> Who said I'm not having any fun? I'm having fun. This is like friggin' Candyland right now. Wait, aren't you all, like, friends? I'm friends with Nona, and I'm downgrading Ren to, like, a creepy neighbor. And you, I just met. <laughs> yeah, I'm... Hey, yeah. what about me? What about me? What about you? Whatever. Just plain rude, ain't it? Oh, you walking so fast. Fire! Man's great equalizer. Bleh. So, what's the, um, what's the, like, thing to do here? Other than obviously go skinny dipping and get murdered by Jason Krueger. Uh, I'm yeah, up for whatever. I think it's just whatever. Well, I'm up for pretty much whatever, so. Hey, where does that old woman live? Oh, you mean Maggie Adler? Yeah. Nowhere. She's dead. What? Yep, killed over three days ago. It was oh all God. over the news. Local news, anyway. Oldest living resident. Her family's been moving back and forth on the ferry, getting all of her crap. Hey, we could go see her house. It must be huge. She was rich as No, a we can't see her house. There's a giant fence, and I don't want to tear my jeans trying to climb it. Oh. And to answer your previous question, Jonas, the thing to do is lay on the beach and drink till you can't remember where you are. And sometimes play truth or slap. Yeah, let's play that. We can inaugurate Jonas. What's truth that? or slap? What's that? We used to call it hippo, until we got tired of people asking, why is it called hippo? Because you get to yell, you're a dirty hippo, before you slap someone. Huh. You get asked a question. You have to tell the truth, but if somebody can prove that you lied, the accuser gets to slap you. It's a good, uh, getting to know somebody game. Unless you lie a lot. Uh, how can you prove that somebody lied? Hearsay, rumor, conjecture, the usual. All right, let's just get on with it. Get okay. on. So, first, we're gonna... I'll start. Ren. Uh-huh. Come on, fess up. You want to go out with Nona, right? Clarissa! Wait, wait, wait! I want to hear... Oh, his... man. You're good at this. Well, if being good means being kind of mean about it... Look, it's tough to gauge. Uh, something mm -hmm. like... Enough stalling. I know you want to sample the goods. Now no. just face it. I, I mean, I, I, I like her as a friend, right? That's... I just like her as a friend. That's... That's all. She's cool. She's... All she's great. Right. Right. Great. Let's just move on. Okay, it's Ren's turn, right? He gets to ask somebody something. Alex, Alex, Alex! <laughs> Uh-oh. Okay, uh, just take, take it, it easy. easy, all right? Tis all in good fun. Hey, no partnering up to be pansies. Silence! Okay, Mary screw kill. Me, Nona, and Clarissa. Why? <laughs> it's fun. It's funny, I don't know. And Jonas is family now, technically. So he's excluded. Well, I'd marry Nona. I like the quiet Hi. types. I'm flattered, I think. <laughs> okay, you're going down the line. I do, Ren. We know each other the best, so it'd be like less weird. And you're in a band. Okay. Yeah! I knew those bass lessons would come in handy. Which, of course, means that you'd strangle Clarissa in her sleep if you ever got the chance. Huh. What a shocker. <laughs> She got what was coming to her. Yeah, I mean, you did shove her into the community pool in sixth grade. What? I did? <laughs> I did, didn't I? I she was did? an hilarious kid. So, Alex's turn? Yep, lady's choice. Alex gets to pick who to ask something of. Oh, great, here we go. What's your favorite stuffed animal? Marissa. Oh, boy. Yes, Mum? This is pretty fun just watching, I'll admit. Mm. Well, wait. Do you like anyone? Like 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 anyone there's no one in school worth liking now come on ouch so no i don't but nice try yeah Clarissa's turn now alex you got a new brother pretty exciting 
I'm sure Jonas is excited, or maybe excited isn't the right word. Maybe a little overwhelmed with just everything, you know? Unsure. It's a lot to take in and adjust to. Is there, like, a question coming or what? I'm just saying what Jonas is already thinking. That statistics show if you get divorced once, you're probably going to get divorced again. What? And the fact is, your mom divorced your dad. So let's put his mind at ease and hear why. Okay, uh, just get to whatever point this is getting to. The point is, why'd your parents get a divorce? Just so Jonas can hear it from you. Clarissa, I don't really care why they got a divorce. Just that Alex's mom is happy now. They had... It was just issues, like any other marriage, and they just couldn't get past theirs. Mm. That's complete crap. I know you know why. Specifically why. Just come out with it. I quit, okay? I'm not playing anymore. I don't care about winning if this is what this is. Mm. Wait, let's... Let's not stop like this. We should... Like... Game's over, Ren. I won. And to celebrate, I'm gonna sit on the beach and drink, and maybe, if I'm feeling spicy, even take a nap. Maybe we could And get... that's exactly what Nona's gonna do, too. Fine. Whatever. Be Miss Pouty on the beach all night if you want. Huh. I'm not gonna let you ruin this for me. I appreciate your permission to be pouty. Thank you. Cheese! If you guys in your scavenger hunt or playing Ring Around the Rosie happen to find anything more interesting than a slowly dying starfish, you be sure mm, to just let me know. Super. <sighs> Whatever. Well, I want to inaugurate this bitch by checking out the caves. Nona, want to come? Uh, I mean, I would. I'm very but... clingy, Ren. <sighs> Fine. Jonas, you're a strapping young lad. Help boost me over the fence. The cave's just, uh, yonder. And I guess you expect me to just jump over after? But like I said, you're a strapping young lad. Yeah. Okay, come on. Where are you from again? It's a small town near North Valley. Oh yeah, is it nice? All right guys, this is where I'm gonna stop this episode. So if you guys want more, we can see more in the next video and I'll see you guys. Bye guys.